I got this, um... What? It, I don't know what you call it, but, um... It's like... It's like a Japanese sweet where it's like... Kind of... Hard-shelled... Cookie almost on the outside, but it's usually filled with like... Red bean paste or... Some other like... Um... Sweets... Or something like that. I forgot what it's called. Does anyone know? It's kind of shaped like a square. Uh, oh, a uh, monaka! Yeah, 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 monaka! That's right, monaka. No, not dorayaki. I know what a dorayaki looks like. Usually, it's like a sweet, right? So there's like red bean paste in it and stuff and um, that. So um, I got gifted a set of monaka. Except it was like a region specialty or something, I forget. But I just heard Monica, right? So I was like, oh, it's a sweet. So when I got home, it was like pretty late. I like was unpacking my stuff. I saw the package, I was like, oh, I could use some sweets right now. It's like pretty late, but like, you know, brain can use some sugar. There's gonna be red bean paste in it. So I happily bit into the Monica, except something, something felt wrong. <laughs> My, my taste buds weren't met with the sweetness of the red bean paste Except it was just met with some dehydrated green onions I was like, oh, wait a minute, what? What? Why is there dehydrated veggies in my Monica? And then I looked at the package and it said miso <laughs> So it was like a special monica shaped thing where you make miso soup and you put the monica in the miso soup and it like opens up to the green onions and the naruto. <laughs> I was like, oh. <laughs> and then like in the corner of my mouth there's just like a piece of like dehydrated green onion. <laughs> but the funnier thing is, so I left it open because I was like, oh, I guess I'll just eat it, eat the miso shiro, you know, monaka in the morning with some rice. So I left it, but, um, so I slept. And then apparently Mamanis came by while I was sleeping to pick up something from my house. I woke up, I went down to the kitchen to make, you know, the miso shiro with the monaka, except one of them was missing. I don't remember eating it or giving it to anyone, so I called Mamanis and I was like, Mamanis, did you eat that Monica looking thing on the counter? <laughs> and then she was like, oh yeah, I ate it, but it was a little dry. <laughs> yeah, you know, I thought it was gonna be filled with red bean paste, but you know, it's, it's, it was like, it was kind of dry and kind of tasted a little weird. <laughs> and then I told her, did you, did you see the package like that came with the monaka? And I told her it was supposed to be me, so she did it with the monaka. <laughs> and she was like, oh. And then she, she just tops it up with, no wonder there's a piece of green onion stuck on my teeth. <laughs> I can't believe she didn't realize something was wrong and she just ate. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I mean, that's the thing. Mamonis can't read Japanese, right? So she didn't read the miso that was written on the package that was packaged with Monica. <laughs> but to be fair, it looked exactly like how a sweets would look like. It was packaged like nicely. It looked like one of those like fancy omiyage, you know, you give to someone else. But... Um, yeah, you know, that was a that was a pretty funny thing. I just remembered because while I was getting the tea, the Monica package was still... I still have two left over. It was beside the hot water machine, so... <laughs> it was great, it was great, yeah.